Alright folks, welcome back to another episode in the Valencia career mode, and um, as you can see from this, we aren't doing uh, very <laughs> well. We uh, we lost 5-0 at home to Real Madrid. We beat Gijon 3-0. We then lost 2-0 to Atletico. We lost 2-1 to Vigo. And then we just beat um, Pampelona 2-1, only because Jose Gaia stepped up in the 92nd minute. So it's still a bit of a torrid time for us here. We're about to play Barcelona in Espanyol afterwards. Um, both arguably must-win games. Uh, I can't see us getting anything from Barcelona, unfortunately. Um, the team is just... Nobody wants to step up. Like The only player is Jose Gaia. He's the leading scorer. Three goals. <laughs> A left back. The Valencia through and through is Jose Gaia. Pretty sure, yeah. Valencia through and through. He didn't he didn't ask to leave. Didn't want to go to a bigger club. He's the only one that actually cares at this moment. Everyone else is in average, average form. Teddy Andre's doing alright. He's doing better than De Gea. De Gea is in shocker every time the ball goes near him. It's in the back of the net. No idea why. Maybe. Like, I don't want to play like two deep line. I could play two deep line playmakers actually. If we swapped those two around and we chuck a deep line playmakers on support. And we chuck this fella in as a deep line playmaker on support. Okay. We could just play three deep line playmakers on support. <laughs> No. Who's like the beast? This guy's this guy's an advanced playmaker. You could be a Mazala though, mate. See, I don't know what like if these are even gonna do anything. Uh, like obviously you want Diwara in the middle. Maybe like you can be a box to box Moro. I think you'd be better as a Mazala on attack though. I think that's what we probably want to go for. Maybe two Mazalas. Got Tabanui. Um, oh, yeah, actually. <laughs> New fella has uh, joined us, folks. Um, he's just on, on loan from Manchester United. Um, yeah, um, <laughs> played in France last year and scored 25 goals in 33 games. So, yeah, that, that was a pretty good, uh, pretty good deal for us. Um, it was to replace where is he where is he there David Okariki he finally left went to Everton for 69 mil with uh, potential add ons 57 up front he's already played twice and scored twice so good on him so I bought in the um, uh, yeah Benesa Benali that's his name I think this is what we're going to try today, folks. Everyone is reasonably fit, yeah. So I'm going to go Jose Gaia. Back four, yeah, back four of Jose Gaia, Saar, Alvidi, and Hendricks. Andre in a goal. Diwara, Almendra, Moro, Tibanui, Benali, and Gonzalez leading the front line. De Gea, Stora, Jerry, Press, Calvo, Gomez, and King on the bench. I think I will take King off. He didn't impress me, um hugely um, as a striker when he came on in the other game so where's where's my other striker I forgot their bloody names Kibby Voland, he's one is he even like the better one though I don't think so we've got Casper Dolberg as well who do we want, Voland or Dolberg neither of them are scored to be honest so We'll, we'll go with Voland because he's played in bigger matches in the past. Well, let's get into the game against Barcelona then. Who do they got? Gabby Jesus, Sancho, Pedri, Pogba, Grealish, Neves, Samascus, Scudier, Ferrero, Ferro, Conchal. It's just a it's it's a hard team, and I can't see much happening out of this. Like we're obviously not playing attacking. 
if anything, we should be playing pretty cautiously. Let's kick off, folks. Let's see what we can do. <laughs> Oh, we just need to have more of the ball. I'll tell you what's been happening is it, it's really not the defence that's the problem. The um, the finish, this the finishing is just atrocious, and I don't know why my strikers just can't score. What on earth? Thirty seconds into the match, we already concede. Oh, this is not going to work out for us here. We've made I've made a horrific mistake moving to Valencia I'm going to get sacked aren't I oh they've scored again folks he's Teddy Andre is actually having a worse performance than De Gea so far look at this I did not think that was getting in how do you just run into your own player what are you doing He's, how does he still have a 6.9? He's conceded two goals. Hasn't even been 10 minutes yet. He's about to concede fucking three. Come on. I know we're playing at the Camp Nou. I know everyone's still relatively new. They haven't gotten their chemistry as playing together. But Alvidi's just been robbed against Jesus. We've just conceded three in 10 minutes. Alvidi, you're a Swiss international, bro. How do you do this? Come on. <laughs> we do... Sancho gets tackled. Pogba's going to get it. What are we going to do? We're going to concede four. Probably. Oh, Alvidi, you actually did something right there. You just get it out of play. Grealish with the corner, it's probably, oh, Gaia, see, only one with any stones in the team, only one that actually likes Valencia and actually wants to perform. If we've got a team of Jose guys, we'd, we'd, we'd win the league, we'd trounce it, and Sancho blasts one wide, Pfft, I don't know what I'm doing, folks, we sacked before the next episode at this rate. Sars gone off injured. Store is coming on. <laughs> this is not gonna go very well, is it? Three now at half time. It is very, very disappointing. I'm not happy. Can I? I can't make a comment. I've already said it. I'm not happy with anyone, to be honest. They're all just as bad as each other. Apart from Jose Guy, he gets a pass every game because he's the only one that actually wants to show that he wants to be here. What are they going to do? Whip it across. Tomato Gabby Jesus scores his fourth. Come on, bro. We Can you calm down? We used to play together. I signed you at Nice, buddy. On, on loan. You almost won us the league, but not quite. Why do we have to... <laughs> Oh, where's the defence? I was just saying the defence is not what's wrong with the team. It's the attack. It's, but this game proves it's bloody everyone. Oh, God. Here we go. Another highlight. I'm on my edge of my seat every time they're coming forward. Oh, whisker away. See, I was playing some games with Switzerland before, and Teddy Andre is absolutely astounding in goal there, but how does he get the best look at that folks, 50-50 possession See, I, I can't blame Teddy Andre, I, unfortunately I can for m the majority of the goals actually, but even still even after that he still gets player of the match for 10 shots saved that just goes to show how ridiculously poor we are at finishing Look at that. We had 21 fouls. They just annoyed us. And then we got no shots on target. Two shots in the game to their 31. Look, mate. You are... I'm going to say... I'm going to reluctantly say... 
people cautiously. Appreciate your efforts, you were unlucky. Okay, so I'm not happy with anything, because I'm really not. And now we've got a game against Espanol. Sars injured. Oh, fuck off. No. Oh, broken lower league. Seeing a specialist. Oh, no. Talk to Sar. Oh. <laughs> the possibility to deregister him from the squad and pick another replacement. Yeah, I think we're going to have to do that. Hold on, folks. We'll be back for the game, the next game. I forgot to show you a, another signing that is uh, coming in. Ted Bond from um, IAC. Uh, no, AZ as well. Uh, sorry. He is joining us. He was listed by request. We've put in a 37 mil. Here we go. Let's have a look. We've put that's his contract. Fairly decent. Fairly decent. Doesn't have a minimum fee release clause for him. So that's fine with me. Yeah, we put in uh, 29 mil, 47 in uh, total, I believe it is. And yeah, he is coming in. Right, what what can we do here? What can we do? Can anyone else play up there? No, not really. Sars injured for quite some time, so it's, it's going to be Stora that comes in. I'm going to have to get Evan Tahini back. So it's going to be Alvidi and Tahini, <laughs> as they say. I'm going to chuck. No, I'm not actually. Gonna get Benjamin Hendricks back in. Uh, I am just trying to figure out. Here we go. Lauenberg is gonna come in and play as our other off the bench centre back. I think I might bring Kevin Volland in for Benali. I think Benali has not showed his best form. I don't think most of the players will show their best form, to be honest. I think... Who's playing the worst out of these fellas? 6.82. It's Nicola Moro. So what if we just chuck Moser in there? Yeah, he's good. Plays that role reasonably well. Not that it matters all that much. Playing attacking. We're going away to Espanyol. Let's just do it. Let's just get it over with. See what happens. Here's the team. Gaia, Alvidi, Tahini, Bendri Hendricks, Teddy Andre, Almeida, Diara, Musa, Tabanui, Dolberg, and Gonzalez. Gonna, we're going to win this. All we need is a few wins in succession. And the confidence will be back. We just need a bit of confidence. Alrighty. Espanyol are on the attack. And Vargas is uh, looking dangerous. And, oof, we are very lucky that uh, Cleary there missed. Oof, what are we going to do with this team, folks? Leave me suggestions <laughs> on how you would play this team. Who I should play. You know the players. Who should I play? What formation I should be trying? Why they're not, like working, uh, do I need to fit even more team bonding in, you know, because <laughs> it's not going according to plan, I'm going to get sacked before too long if this keeps up, like, we're in 12th with 7 points, after 7 games, I want to say 7 games, something like that, yep, 7 games, 7 points, it's very average, it's not very good. We need to be better. And I don't know how. Because transfer window's closed. Can't bring anyone else in. Tough players just aren't doing their stuff on the pitch. I and mean, my tactics worked perfectly at Nice. Granted, it was slightly different formation and we had different players and everything. But that, that more or less worked. And it doesn't seem to be paying off here. As Diawaris shoots it straight at the goalkeeper. You dick. Why would you do that? It's not hard 
Surely someone other than Jose Gaia can score today. Benjamin Hendricks, really? Oh, you have got to be kidding. That went in the net and out. Surely that went in the net and out. Not even a replay. Not even a fucking replay. Come on, Tahini. Oh, I'm pissed. Like, look at that. All of these players to make a bloody difference. You're not doing it. Jose Guy is going to come up clutch in the 90 something minute a game. We can't just rely on him because he's not going to be able to play every game. Disgraceful from this team. Like, they're playing like a bunch of individuals, but not playing like a team. Pedroza, they've scored. No. Right, Teddy Andre was all over that, though. See, he is a good keeper. He is... Uh, all right, we're making some changes, because... Almendra's been trash. Dolberg has been trash. Let's get them off. Almendra Press is coming on. Gomez is going to come on. Swap them around. Eh, nah, keep them as they... Come on, let's see what we can do. <laughs> Come on, buddies. I mean, this is not really Tobias Press's role. I might change him in um, thingy round after this highlight. Diwara. Oh, come on. Do not score. Come on. Why do we... Wu Li, great save from Teddy there. Come on. Yeah, let's swap those two around. And that makes them a bit more comfortable. All right, come on, Tabernet. We whip in across, bro. Come on. Even now, come on, Tahini. Let's start something, Tobias. Come on. We've got a no chance of getting top four football if this is how we're going to be playing every game. We can't even beat Espanyol. Where are they even in the league? I can't even see them. The 14th. Come on, mate. At least get me another win. Oh, I told you. Jose Gaia is gonna have to come up clutch. I was wrong about the time. But this man, I should be playing him as a striker. Fourth goal of the season. We don't even have Champions League football to, like, worry about. We don't have any European football to worry about. We should just be focusing on the league. We should be focusing... Oh my god. We've just scored... And we've just conceded like that. That's ridiculous. That's that's disgusting. The defence needs to be better than that. Come on. Taking Gaia off. That's a bit of a risk. But we've got to keep him fit. We've got to keep him fit. Because he's the only one that's going to do anything. I've got to take the draw at this stage. That's ridiculous. I can't believe we've drawn to Espanyol. I'm actually going to get sacked. Like... Where's, where's Gaia? Where's Gaia? I want to tell him. I want to passionately say, I'm proud of your performance. You've earned some rest. The rest of you, I actually don't care. <sighs> That'll do it for today's episode, folks. Um, what games I'm going to bring you back for? Uh, these two, Bill Bow and Real Batiste. Sounds good to me. Drop a like, let me know how to fix this disgrace of a team. Drop a comment, drop a like, subscribe if you want to see more of me failing at Football Manager. And um, yeah, thanks a ton for watching, catch you in the next one, peace.